Hi, good morning. Um, little video about um, clothing and what to put baby in. Particularly cold this morning, so I thought I'd just do this video. We get lots of questions about this. We have done a little poster, which is on our page, um, about the different points of um, things that you can do and how you can keep baby warm. Don't recommend snowsuits, thick coats, any kind of really thick padded cardi or sort of layered up cardi with big hoods. Difficult to get a good position in any sling or carrier um, and sometimes babies can overheat. So we like to layer up. So I'm just going to show you what this baby's got on and some little tips on how you can keep baby warm. So this is about three to six month size um, demo doll. Um, and as you can see, they look nice and snug and warm. So um, we'll normally go with something that doesn't have feet in, preferably. So some kind of legging dungarees, something like that, maybe tights even, which are okay because they, they're sort of stretchy and flexible. You want to be able to have babies be able to flex their feet freely and also flex their knees freely within the, the sling or carrier. So this particular baby has got on a pair of blade and rose leggings, those ones with a little pattern on the bottom, which are really sweet. They're like a slightly thicker, stretchier, woollier, but not scratchy woolly type of um, legging and they're, they're really stretchy, so they're great. They look a bit like this, comes in loads of different patterns and nice and stretchy. They also last quite a long time, which is quite nice. And like any type of thing like that, H&M, Primark, various shops like that do that kind of thing. That's another little pair I had, sort of slightly thicker woolier, or you can get the leggings that have um, like a bit of a fleece lay on the inside, um, which are also quite good. Okay, so um, additionally, I'd probably go for a vest, short or long sleeve. My preference is normally a short sleeve, plus a long sleeve top on top and then some kind of cardi on top of that. So anything that you've got that maybe you've got that's been knitted for you, I used to get loads of things like that, are really good. Keep babies nice and warm and snug and they're just nice and snugly fitted on baby. Additionally, a hat. I really like these ones, which are like a bonnet style um, that have a little tie under their chin. Nice and snug, comes down round, right around the face and ears as well, so it keeps them nice and warm. Additionally, a little tube scarf, um, which look like this little tube scarf I used to like as well nice my daughter still likes to wear these she's three now um, but those are really nice as well you can just pop them in underneath their cardi and it keeps them nice and snug around there some kind of booty I've got various different ones this is a little knitted sort of sock booty that I could put on or there's a fleece variety you could also get a kind of thin slate one which has maybe got a slightly tougher sole if your babies are sort of starting to toddle and um, some with drawstrings that kind of thing Little hat is also another good one, um, and also of this type of thing is quite nice as well. Just an extra little layer that you can pop on underneath the cardi, gives them some nice warmth around the chest and neck. Okay, so once you've got lay baby layered up, nice and snugly, well, odd socks, but that's okay. Um, I'm just going to show you another couple of things that you can do. So I've got a carrier on here, and I'm just going to pop baby in. This particular carrier is a Kahu baby I'm going to use today. So, get baby, pop them on your chest and let's get baby in so you can get baby wearing coats of very different types um, even some people have maternity coats that have got like an extra panel you can buy specific coats that do that um, but you don't have to I never had one and I've had four children but you um, if you know if you want something that's nice and um, purpose for this then that's absolutely fine you can do that um, you can also buy various covers that go over slings so Bundle bean is one that springs to mind. Um, again, these sort of clip on. But again, you don't have to have anything really specific. Um, you can just do it yourself. Okay, so I've got my baby in. They're nice and snug. I can see that they've got a nice clear gap under there. I can see their face. It's nice and tight. It's the right width. It's not overstretching my baby's legs. Um, and I've tightened it up. Okay, so if you feel that you still think baby's legs might be a little bit cold these are also really good little baby leggings uh, leg warmers they're sort of stretchy you can just pop those on as well additionally so just slide that on just give an extra layer on baby's legs these I think when I've looked online they start about six months but you can just just have them wrinkly it's fine you can just fold them over so that's another layer that you could pop on if you really need thought that you're going out for a long time for a long walk and it's really chilly um again you can also get sometimes you can buy extra panels like this this is a fleecy panel it has a zip now obviously it depends on your coat and whether it's going to match the zip but that is another option something like that that you actually 
zip it into your coat and that then becomes an extra layer um, on top of baby. Um, if you don't have anything like that, um, sometimes um, a little small uh, toddler coat can be a, a good idea as well because you can pop that in, tuck it in and then it's got a hood and you can pop that over. It's like a raincoat type thing. Or just a nice big wide scarf. So something with a nice big wide scarf like this. This also works really well. Keeps you warm and the baby warm. So I'm pop that around you and then you can just bring it round. You can always just tuck it in on one side and the same on that side. So I used to wear one of these a lot when I was going on the school run. Um, in the mornings, I would just get one of those and just pop that around both of us. Um, baby's still nice and snug and secure in there. Just <clears throat> the thing to think about is that each sling, so if you're wearing a buckled style carrier, it, it's already one extra layer. So you just have to factor that into the clothing that they're wearing. Again, they're against your body, so they're gonna get your body heat as well. Um, if you're wearing a stretchy, um, then again, you have three layers additionally there already. So it's worth considering those extra three layers that you have on for baby um, and may need to go down a layer or two. But things like that are really simple to do. Like I said, really, really easy to do. Just wrap around you, keeps you and baby warm. It means that you don't need to wear a really thick padded coat as well. Um, and you can sort of layer up as well. So the more you layer up, then if you get warm, you can you can layer down as well because it can be a warm business wearing babies, even in this weather. But yep, yeah, I'm happy that my baby's nice and snug and warm in there and I'm ready to go out for a walk. Okay, hope you have found this useful. Thank you, bye-bye.